Hi folks, Debbie Ray here, the gardener wife. It's garden walk day, so we are doing a quick tour ahead of time. This is the front yard perennial garden, named, recently named the Shakespeare Street Garden. Because we have the Shakespeare quote down there, and the Shakespeare Street sign there. Some house plants and containers in the back, and lots of good stuff. And here along the driveway is the bulk of the container vegetable garden. It's got tomatoes, peppers, ground cherries, and eggplants. And down at the end of the driveway, potting bench, more container vegetables, rain barrels, and the entrance. Just to the right of the gate under the lilac tree is the Midsummer Night's Dream Fairy Garden. With the swing for the changeling, a bower for Queen Titania, and over there the way towards Athens. Kitchen garden Hugo Coulter bed with berries growing in it, apple trees that I grafted, and a new bed starting out here, which the beginnings of the wishy washy washerwoman garden. Here's a quick walk down into the kitchen garden raspberries, herbs, and edible flowers bed tomatoes, celery growing between them, wax beans in the middle, Mrs. Green Beans with a pole bean skirt, zinnias, snow peas, last bed here, leeks and beets, radishes, and on the other side of the bikes, a couple of cucamelons. And coming back, broccoli bed, which also has um, bunching onions, lots of borage that self sowed. Love these edible flowers. Sweet Spanish white onions, and pak choy that has bolted. And then coming back, another legume bed the snow peas, bean towers, another bed with the tomatoes and wax beans and celery. I also put a peanut plant in each of these tomato beds, giving that a try for the first time. Strawberry bed with kale that overwintered growing in it. Then on this side is the cottage style garden bed. from the lilac in the corner. Hummingbirds have been visiting the bee balm here. They love it. All the way down to the mock orange at the other end here. This is the asparagus bed. Got poppies in the front and an Asian pear that I want to espalier in the back of it. And then on the deck is an ornamental container garden. What I like to call my flower bestrewn deck. A little cooking corner, an antique stove too. So, lots of things blooming around here. And my window boxes are mostly edibles this year. Tumbling Tom yellow tomatoes, sweet cherry peppers. Here's the planter that Beatrice was living for a while. And we can see over the corner here 
a view of the Mackinac Island Garden where we'll go next. So of course I have a bike here for the Mackinac Island theme and I have a grand hotel, white rocking chair, red geraniums are a signature of the Grand Hotel too. So I've got some here, the chair, and over there on the mantle. And then tucked in across from the mantle is the Mackinac Cottage Fairy Garden. which also has little miniature geraniums in there from the Grand Hotel gift shop. So, and that's how the garden looks on Garden Walk Day today.